Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm back with another video. Um, I'm sure a lot of guys, like most of you know my love for lipsticks and how I always look out for new launches and I bring them to you, swatch them, review them. So in today's video, I'm going to review one of the newest launches, which is L'Oreal Paris Infallible Matte Resistance Liquid Lipsticks. So I saw them online and I had to buy them. I love liquid lipsticks. I love the ease. I love the uh, longevity and everything about them. So I thought, let me pick few shades for you all and swatch them plus test them in today's video. So the range looks stunning with beautiful nine shades and I ended up picking these three that appeal to me the most and I'll swatch them as well as test out brand's claims in today's video. Let's talk about the stylish color-coded tubes first. This is how the tube looks like from up close. It represents the color inside and the sponge tip applicator is very nice and pointy. The pointy tip helps with getting a really nice and precise uh, lipstick application without the use of a lip liner. So let's start with the swatches first. So the first I have number 245 French Kiss which is such a beautiful, uh, I think it's more like a strawberry pink color with red undertones. Look at the pigmentation, it is so pigmented. You just need one stroke. Uh, my lips are pigmented, like my upper lip is darker than lower, but you cannot see it now. Very opaque, as you can see, one swipe was all I required and my lips are covered completely. Like the name suggests, it is a matte formula and as you can see, it has settled down and it looks absolutely matte now. So I have a clean tissue here, as you can see, it's a clean tissue. Uh, we are going to see whether it transfers onto this tissue or not. There is no transfer at all which is really good. I mean, I'm not surprised. I've already been testing these out for some time. There is no transfer at all. Let's check out the next shade, which is number 150 Lady Sunday. I'll be honest, I personally love this color. This is like one of my favorite shades out of all the three colors I have. You'll see how beautiful it looks on me. See, this is a very, very, very pretty um, brown with red undertones. This is one of those colors that look absolutely gorgeous with zero makeup. So I wore this color to Lori function and this stayed put even through meals. So this, this definitely stays on uh, and doesn't fade or smudge or move at all. So I personally really, really love this color. I cannot recommend it enough. This is going to look absolutely smashing on all skin tones, especially if you are medium to deeper skin tone. Uh, this is a very beautiful everyday color for them. But the brand has also claimed about the transfer proofness of the formula, which means it's also a kiss proof formula. So we'll test it out today. I'm going to kiss the back of my hand and show you like, as you can see, it is clean. It is still clean. So there is no transfer whatsoever and the formula feels so good on the lips. It is very, very lightweight. Uh, it is very, uh, very, very comfortable. And talking continuously, my lips are not feeling cracked or parched. Now, the third shade that I have here is 500 Wine Knot. And as the name suggests, it's a very, very pretty wine color. See, the color is so gorgeous. And the best part, like, it doesn't need retouches. I personally prefer uh, formulas that don't need retouching because retouching is something I... I do not prefer at all during the day. So I'm going to go ahead and do the wear test and see whether the infallible lips that resist or not. For the wear test, I'm going to wear the shade Lady Sunday. So it's 2.30 now and I'm having some lunch, some light snacks. And these are very oily, like the momos and the french fries were very oily. But when I'm wiping my lips, you'll see there is zero transfer on the tissue. The lipstick feels so good and so comfortable because it contains hyaluronic acid. Now I'm drinking the tea and having my snacks at 5.30. You can see there is no transfer on the cup at all. So I'm back after a full day of outing. It's almost... 7.30 now and uh, as you can see the lipstick is still there. Uh, even from close up you can see there is barely any fading. Generally lipsticks fade from the center. There is no fading at all. My makeup like whatever I had on has faded but the lipstick is still going strong and there is absolute no transfer. It did not bleed outside the lip lines. Uh, there was no transfer at all and it did not flake or moved and my lips are not feeling dry or chapped or cracked, which is really amazing. I'm really impressed. I'll give it two thumbs up. So to conclude today's video, I'm going to highly recommend these lipsticks. 
these are prices to be triple nine and i'm going to link them in the description box below do not forget to check them out i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and found it helpful if you did do not forget to give it a big thumbs up if you're watching me for the first time please subscribe to my channel and i'll see you very very soon in my next video till then take care and bye